Hey guys, get ready with me to see Chelsea for the first time in like two months. She's been away at college all summer playing soccer. That's why I haven't seen her, but I'm seeing her today. I'm so excited. We're gonna go shopping. I need to get a bunch of stuff for my dorm. I haven't gotten anything for my dorm. I have no sheets, nothing. Also, y'all, my room is so messy right now. I don't know if y'all saw my room tour, but it was so clean and I kept it like that for two weeks. Two weeks of keeping my room clean is like the biggest world record for me. And I got back from LA last night and it just it went crazy. Like there's just clothes everywhere, all over my floor. My desk is completely messed up as well. And I just, I can't. I don't even know how to like clean it up. I don't even know how to put everything away because there's just no room for it. I'm just gonna put it in boxes and bring it with me to college. This is what I'm talking about. Look at my desk. Coming back from vacation is like the worst. Speaking of LA though, my vlog will be up hopefully sometime this week. It's going to take a long time for me to edit because there's just so many like footage. And I'm also just so new to the whole editing thing. But a lot of you guys said you really liked my editing in the two videos that I posted on YouTube. And it made me so happy because I literally, I used iMovie. And the only reason I got it to look decently nice was because I had to do a bunch of like overlapping and overlays and green screens. And honestly, it took so much time. Like I would have saved so much time editing if I had like a more advanced app. So I'm thinking about getting Final Cut Pro. I've heard so many good things about it, but it's $400 on the app store. I do feel like it's a good investment though, especially if it's gonna save me so much time editing. So I also saw that there's a lot of like cool features on there and like sound effects, music and whatnot. So I do think it's worth it. So I think I might give it a go. Also, my hair is just looking so not it today. Like I washed it yesterday and there's like a bunch of baby hairs. Like there's just a bunch of hair flying all over the place and it's pissing me off. I also might change my shirt because it's so hot out today. I don't know why put a long sleeve on. I haven't been so pissed off over my hair in so long. This is so annoying. Jumbo setting spray. Doing my lashes. I'm powdering up because it's so hot. I'm like melting. My whole face is melting. Okay, I'm done. Bye guys. Hey guys, get ready with me. I got my nails done yesterday. They're pink and chrome. You can't really tell that they're chrome, but it's okay. It's like a little bit shiny. I actually really like them. I got them for back to school and they remind me of Barbie. Also, guys, I'm so excited for you guys to see my LA vlog. I was editing it all night, last night, and then this morning too. It's not quite finished yet, but I hope I can have it uploaded like early this week. Also, I took your guys' advice and I used CapCut. A lot of you guys suggested that because Final Cut Pro was so pricey. You guys were like $400 and I'm like, yeah, $400 freaking dollars for that stupid editing app. But honestly, I feel like there has to be a reason to why it's $400. So if anyone has Final Cut Pro, let me know if it's worth it. But so far, CapCut is like pretty good. So, yeah, also, some of you guys suggested Adobe. Adobe? Um, I used that app in grade 11 because I was in a media design class. And honestly, it was pretty good. Like, it definitely did its job, but... It, ow! Sorry. Um, it did its job, but it was just so, like, kind of complicated to use. Like, there was all these, like, buttons. And I need, like, a really basic layout to do my thing. Anyways, guys, I paid my dorm tuition last night. And I actually wanted to, like, snap my head off. Like, holy cooter, why is my dorm, like, almost the same price as my tuition fee? My dorm for the first term, just the first term, guys, was $6,500. And, like, I know a lot of people pay, like, way more than that. But $6,500? My sister paid, like, way more because she went to a different school than me. But still... Some of my friends paid like $17,000, which is crazy, but $6,500 is so much money. I don't even know how much my tuition is, but $6,500 is just for the first term. Like, 
but I like to think of it as an investment because education is very important to me and it will always come first. Anyways, enough about that. Um, I still need to buy things for my- I'm doing all of that today. I'm ordering everything on Amazon. Amazon's just so quick and easy, so that's just what I'm going to do. But other than that, I have a super chill day today. And I'm actually, like, so excited to move. Like, obviously, I love living at home. Like, I have free groceries here. But, like, I'm also, like, so excited to just be on my own. And it's coming up so soon. Like, it's getting me nervous. Lippy. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. Get ready with me using Tatcha for the first time. This showed up on my doorstep, like, a few hours ago. And I was like, what is this huge box doing here? And look at the little note. Special delivery for Kitty Fang. Stop. I love them. Look at... Oh, my goodness. I've never owned anything from Tatcha, so I'm, like, so excited. Okay, the first thing I see is this... The Essence. I wonder what this is. I feel like it could be a toner, possibly. <gasps> the packaging of everything is just so... <gasps> oh my god. <gasps> it's glass. I feel like this is definitely like a toner of some sort. Okay, the next thing is a cleansing oil. I already cleansed my face, so unfortunately, I will not be using this. Look at how pretty this is. Okay, this next thing is called the Rice Polish Classic curious to see what these are like oh it's like matching okay this is an exfoliator so this is a makeup remover and like cleansing oil and this is an exfoliator okay the last thing in here is their most popular item their moisturizer i've seen this oh, all over social media look this is gorgeous and it comes with a little like spatula okay first thing i'm going to use is the plumping skin treatment this is what it's actually called I feel so scared using this. Oh, <gasps> whoa. Sorry, this is like the coolest thing ever. Oops, I think I did too much. Oh, it smells so refreshing. It feels like a really refreshing, cooling water on your skin. It's so nice. Okay, now I'm going to be trying their moisturizer. This is the Dewy Skin Cream, and I'm going to use this little spatula it comes with. Guys. The cream is purple. Okay, I'm just going to use the access on the lid because don't want to waste any. <gasps> okay, I think that's good. I can already smell it and it smells delicious. Okay, putting the little spatula back. Now I'm going to... Oh my god, it's so thick and moisturizing. I'm like freaking out over nothing. This is not sponsored at all, by the way, guys. This is actually like my first time trying it. And it actually feels so rich on the skin, like... My skin's going to be hydrated for days. <laughs> Alright, y'all. I'm definitely going to be trying these two products another day. But thank you so much, Tatcha. I loved everything. Bye, guys. Look at that shine. I just found the perfect lip gloss for back to school. This is the new Glossy Bounce from Say Beauty. This is in the shade Kiss. Literally the perfect shade for a natural dewy look. I've been wearing this all day and I've only had to reapply once or twice. Also, I just want to show you guys something real quick. This is their dew blush in the shade Rosy. I paired this blush with the gloss in the shade Kiss. Look at that. I think they just go so well together. I kid you guys not, this gloss has the perfect texture. Not sticky at all. And the best thing about this is it comes in six different shades. This one's in the shade Play. It is such a gorgeous pink. This is going to be my go-to party shade. Don't know about y'all, but my lips are always super naturally just dry. And this literally keeps them hydrated all day. I cannot wait for you guys to try these. Hey guys, do my lashes with me. Okay, we're back again doing my lashes. These are the individual lashes from Quell Lashes on Amazon. I'll put the link in the caption and the comments if you guys want to go check them out. But I always use these lashes. Also, it comes with a bond and seal, by the way, if you guys were wondering. And I just put the bond directly on the lash so my eyes don't get all sticky. Okay, I'm actually going to use my new bond and seal because the other one, the bond kind of dried out because I didn't close it properly. So, this one's brand new and fresh. Okay, this is 12 inch. I always start with 12 inch. Also, I already got glue in my eyes, so ignore that. Okay, I did two 12 inches. Now I'm going to do um, 11 inch in the middle section. 
Okay, I got two 11s in the middle, and now I'm doing 10 in the very corner. Okay, this eye is done. Now I'm putting the seal on. I'm going for a really, like, natural look, so they don't look, like, that big. Alright, on to my left eye, starting with 12 again. Okay, I'm zooming it in so you guys can see the application process, but this is my third 12 inch because this eye is like longer for some reason so all right y'all i did three 12 inch three 11 inch now i'm going with just one 10 inch on the very inner corner i'm gonna show y'all how it's done i'm just gonna stick that right there Ta-da! okay now i'm gonna put the seal on and then i'm gonna clamp them as well Okay, I'm clamping. Oh. Alright guys, I'm done. Hi guys. Hey guys, get ready me to go shopping. I don't know if y'all can hear outside, but it's pouring rain today. Like, this is probably the second time this summer that it's rained. And I'm gonna be so honest, I'm loving it. Like, I miss the rain so much. I actually love fall a lot. Like, obviously I love summer, but... Uh, I've been in the heat for too long. So yeah, basically I'm going shopping for my dorm. We're going to Ikea because I have no blankets, no sheets, nothing. So we're finally getting that today. And then we're also going to go get like toiletries or something. I don't know. And I think I'm getting a new phone today because my plans expired. So I get a new phone for free. And I'm so excited. I've had this phone for like three, four years, which is not that long to be honest and i honestly have like no problem with this phone i love this phone so much i have the 12 pro max right now and i love it and like i also just have such big attachment to phones so my plan actually expired like a year ago and i just kept putting it off because i love this phone so much but i like it's time to get a new phone like my battery goes out so fast and i can feel it like disintegrating if that makes sense but yeah, I think I'm just going to keep this phone. I was debating on selling it so I can get some money back, but I I want to keep it. Uh, I just got an email from my English professor. Oh my god. Why do I look so pale right now? I need to bronze up. Like, the middle? Oh. That was the first email I've ever received from any prof, so I'm like, so nerd. But he's just talking about, like, textbooks. I ain't buying a $400 textbook. I should probably start packing. I move in, like, a week, and I haven't packed a single thing i genuinely don't know how i'm gonna pack all my clothes my makeup my my skincare like what um i'll just figure it out later i think i'm just gonna bring suitcases because i was gonna do like boxes but i can't carry that up the stairs because i'm on the third floor so i have to go up two flights of stairs but guys i know i already said this but chelsea and i are on the same floor same building we're like eight doors down I'm, we're probably gonna ask someone if we can like switch rooms just so we can be right next door to each other but i'm so excited i'm actually just so glad that i'm going with someone that i already know she's like my best friend if you see my old videos it's all with her like throughout all of high school we were like this we still are i just haven't seen her in so long i did see her like two days ago though but i saw her maybe like twice all summer because she's been gone so i'm excited to see or to practically like live with her don't even have to do my lashes because I have lash extensions on now. So I'm just going to do some lippy. Alright guys, I'm done. Bye guys! Hey, hey guys, guys, get unready with us for the last time. <laughs> we look a little bit rough. we has been, been crying. But we're going to remove our makeup now. Basically, <clears throat> Nadege is going back to Toronto. I'm leaving tomorrow, but she's going back to college. <laughs> Well, like, technically, I'm moving too, but, like, still, I won't see. She's, like, so far away. <laughs> we need to get rid of all this mascara under our eyes and, like, I thought this eyes. was supposed to be waterproof. Okay, we're gonna spray our faces with the caudalie mist. Oh, Make sure you close your eyes because it's very spicy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nadege, what do you have to say to the people? 
Uh, um, y'all better take care of Katie when I'm gone is what I have to say to people. <laughs> Natty, when's the next time I'm gonna see you? Well, unless you come visit me at school, probably not till December. December break, guys. My face literally feels like putty, like... <laughs> okay, we're doing moisturizer now. I'm using my Tatcha moisturizer. What's the best memory you have of us this summer? I think when we... Ah. <gasps> <laughs> uh. Anyways, I think going to the island together was really oh, yeah. fun. And all our sleepovers, because all our sleepovers were so... Like, no matter the cost, we would always <gasps> yeah, sleep they were so dang. We would have them, like, after my work at, like, 1 or, like, During 4 school. Katie's school. When I would still be in school, she would sleep over, and then she would leave at, like, 6 a.m. Because I would have to go to school at, like, 7. <laughs> I'm going to put some on your fingers. Get it out. I'm just going to put it directly on my eyes. <laughs> This is so sad. Basically, Nadej and I went to high school together, and then she graduated before I did. And then she went off to college, and then we were like this all summer. Now we're both leaving. <laughs> but this is literally it, guys. Like, after we film this video, like, I'm gonna go home. She's not even sleeping over. Yeah, because I'm not flat tomorrow. Put the circle on my nose. Okay, we're using this lip balm. I can't. Can you open it? Guys, we're literally matching. Same tank top, same, same necklace, nails. same nails. Got the same nails. Too good. Mm -hmm. Too good. Okay, we're putting on some of the lippy, lippy balm. Hi guys. <laughs> hey guys, get ready with me. Okay, y'all, I have some really exciting news. First of all. I finally have a link in my bio that takes you to all the products that I use in all my videos. You guys have been asking for like a link in my bio for so long and I just never made one because I was lazy. But I finally have one now and it's like sectioned into categories so it's so easy to use. It has like skincare, makeup, my favorite bronzers, blushes, all that and then you can also click on certain videos and then it lists all the stuff that I use in the video. And it also has all the stuff that I wear, like my whole closet basically. There's a section for that as well. And I'm just so excited for you guys to use it because I get so many comments asking like where I got this and that and like what product I'm using. And I just feel like this is so much easier. Like you can just click on the link and it has all the stuff. So yeah, I'm super excited about that. The second thing I want to say is my LA vlog is now up on my YouTube so excited for you guys to go watch it. I am so proud of this vlog. I really liked how it turned out. My YouTube username is the same exact username as TikTok. I finally got it changed to match up with my TikTok username. Or you can just click the link also in my bio. Just press the Instagram icon. And then it'll just take you out directly to my YouTube page. And yeah, those are like my two major announcements for you guys. I'm just so excited about those two things. Also, I got verified on YouTube, which is so exciting. Um, I'm surprised YouTube got verified before my TikTok or Instagram. But TikTok is just like such a long process and it's kind of annoying, but that it's okay. We're still working on the process for TikTok, so hopefully soon. But if not, it's like not a big deal either. Also, <laughs> ignore the- f I don't know if you can tell, but I have full lash on my left eye. And my right eye is completely naked because I, like, slept on this side of my face last night. I, like, woke up and I thought there were spiders on my bed, but they were just my lashes. <coughs> so, yeah, I thought that was pretty funny, but I can't be bothered to do my whole right eye again. So, I'm just gonna let my left eye, like, fall out. But, like, other than that, I feel like you can't really tell because I did them, like, pretty natural. So, it's not like what my left eye is, like, super, like, big and bold. Alright y'all, setting spray! I can't even be bothered to do my mascara on my right eye. Like, I'm just gonna leave it bald the way it is. Bye guys! Hey guys, get ready with me. This is actually so sad. This is one of my last get ready with me's in my room because I moved to college tomorrow. I've never thought that this day would have come any sooner, but... It's tomorrow, guys. I move tomorrow. Look at all of my stuff, guys. It's actually insane how fast this day has come because it feels like I was just starting my senior year. 
last week I keep getting my one year ago memories and it's just me freaking out about my classes for senior year and here we are I'm not even done packing guys like that's not even half of it I still have to pack all my makeup and skincare I haven't started any of that and that's like the most important thing but nothing has gone in there yet that's skincare or makeup it's just clothes and home stuff so I honestly don't know how I'm gonna make it all fit because I already have three suitcases and guys I do not want to bring boxes because I'm on the third floor of my building and I just I can't lift them and obviously my family's coming with me to move in and everything but I just don't want to go through all that hassle we leave at 7 a.m. tomorrow no our ferry's at 7 a.m. so we'll have to leave at like 6 probably and I'm trying to not to like overpack because I can always come home whenever to just pick up more stuff. I'm like a two hour ferry ride. But at the same time, it's like, do I really want to be going back and forth? No, no. So I'm trying to bring everything in one go. I'm not bringing any of my like big super puff jackets or like puffer jackets for winter. Even though it gets like super cold here in winter. But when I come home for Thanksgiving break, probably I'll go get it then. But guys, I'm just so excited, so nervous. I'm feeling all different types of emotions right now. Okay, I think I went a little crazy on the blush, so we're just gonna soak it up with my beauty sponge. Also, I'm having a really, really bad hair day today, if you can't tell. Funny story, actually. My uncle got me the Dyson Airwrap from Asia, and he brought it over for me to use. I have it here, I'm like so excited to use it. Then I plug it in, and I realize this is not the same plug. This is a different outlet, like, this is what they use in Asia. So in Canada, we have a different, like, port. I don't know. So it just, like, doesn't plug into my wall, so it won't turn on. And the voltage is also so much higher, so if I did somehow get it to plug in, it would, like, burn my hair off. So, yeah, that was kind of disappointing because I was so excited to bring it with me to university and use it, but oh well. I might just end up selling it because there's no way I can use that here, like, at all. Guess I'll just stick to styling my hair with a hair straightener or I might buy the Revlon thing because I'm not buying another Dyson like what how am I even gonna pack this setting spray it's so big curling them lashes mascara is actually just such a chore I hate doing it quick lip gloss and I'm done bye guys there is so much stuff this is my drunk elephant PR unboxing I got too excited and opened it already there is so many goodies, I don't even know where to start. The last package they sent me was all of my essentials and like restocks. And this is all new stuff that I've never tried before. So let's go through it one by one. First thing I see is this jelly cleanser. I've actually heard a lot of good things about this, so I'm really excited to try this out. Oh my god, it's so pretty. I love all of their packagings. Okay, next is this glycolic night serum. I don't know if I said that right, but it's pink. And it looks so pretty. It looks like my blue one, like my hydration serum. But this is like a night serum. So I'm going to do a get I'm ready with me with all this stuff. Next, we have a spray. I didn't even know they had sprays, y'all. This is so interesting. Okay, I definitely want to try it out right now. Oh, it's very refreshing. Next is the Sea Tango Multi multivitamin eye cream always wanted to try their eye cream oops oh look at the orange it's so cute this is their little eye cream i know they have a bunch of like different eye creams but this one's the c tango one next is a power peptide reserve serum what is this this is green i just like looking at the colors cute i need to read into all of this and see what they do for my skin but this looks really cute Okay, next we have a Wonder Wild Miracle Butter. I think this is a oil. I'm not too sure. Oh, it's so cute. This is like Aquaphor. It's like for dried skin, for your lips. This is so cool. Okay, last item is their new B Goldie Drops. This is brand new and it came out like a few weeks ago. I've, seen, I've heard so many good things about this. It's basically like the bronzy drops, but gold, basically. I can't wait to try this. Okay, y'all, I'm gonna do a full face of Drunk Elephant skincare later tonight. So stay tuned for that. Bye, guys. Hey, guys, do my skincare with me using all Drunk Elephant. Also, this is my last Get Unready With Me in my room. Like, I just think that's crazy. 
Anyways, I'm gonna go shower and then I'm gonna wash my face with this jelly cleanser. Hey guys, just got out of the shower. Now I'm just gonna put on this spray. This is the Sake spray. I didn't even know Drunk Elephant had a spray. It sprays out really nice. Okay, now I'm gonna use these two serums. This one is the Resurf Serum. I'm probably gonna get a lot of hate for using two serums. The whole point of this video is just me trying out a bunch of new um, Drunk Elephant products, so I'm gonna use all of it. Okay, this one's like more runnier. I kind of like that one better. Now I'm using my Lala Retro Moisturizer mixed with the hydration, ah, hydration Serum. I'm trying to go fast because I need to repack all of this back into my suitcase because I have to bring everything down to the car. But this is basically my smoothies every morning without the bronzy drops. Okay, now I'm using this eye cream. This I'm really excited about. It's a multivitamin eye cream. I'm just going to do I think I squeezed out way too much. Um, ooh, this feels really nice. That eye cream, this eye cream is wonderful. Last step is this Wonder Wild Miracle Butter. I'm actually most excited to try this. Oh, I need to open this. I read the instructions. It's basically you just put it on dry skin. So it's basically like Aquaphor. It looks like that. I'm just going to put it on my lips. I love this. This is amazing. This one or this one is my new favorite. Anyways, that is my full skincare routine with Drunk Elephant. Bye, guys. Hey guys, get ready with me to move into my dorm. I should have packed my mucosa spray and left my old one, but oh well. But guys, this is my last get ready with me in my room. This sounds so dramatic, but it's true. I'm honestly like, I know I'm forgetting something for sure, so I'll probably have to come home next week and grab it because... There's no way I packed my whole life in three suitcases. It literally looks like I, I'm not even moving tomorrow. Like, look behind me. All my clothes are still there. That's just how much clothes I have. Like, I've packed two suitcases full of clothes and I still have all this left. But it's fine. I'll come back for them, like, during break or something. Because there is there's no way I could have packed all of it. Also, it's 5 o'clock in the morning right now, by the way. I don't know if I even said that. I'm literally mumbling right now because it's so early in the morning. I don't even know what I'm saying. Okay, I think today I'm going to try out the new Goldie Drops because I didn't... Oh, frick! Okay, it fell on my leg, but I just swept it Oops, on my right cheek. Hello? Why is it not coming out? Am I doing something wrong? Okay, so they're basically just gold, but let's blend it out and see what it looks like okay i'm gonna sunscreen up just because i feel like i'm gonna be out and about today also all my makeup is packed so i'm just gonna use what i have left in my drawers i don't know why i didn't pack this concealer this is my merit concealer it's like it was my ride or die all summer so look how red my nose is i like surprisingly still have so much makeup in my drawers like hello all my brushes are gone but i keep telling myself that i'm like literally not moving across the world or the country i'm two hours away so i can just come home whenever i want okay my mom's already texting me and telling me that we have to go but she said we would leave at 6 10 and it's 605 and this is not my brow shade great also guys don't worry i did pack all of my skincare and makeup it's just a lot of the stuff i'm using is extras that i have so don't worry, it looks like I haven't packed anything, but it's all downstairs. Okay, I think we're just gonna... <gasps> this is not highlighter. forgot I packed my Charlotte highlighter, so I'm using this Benefit highlighter in the shade Tickle. I don't have setting spray with me. Are you serious? Oh my god, my eyelash curler is also packed. Okay, I'm just gonna find an eyelash curler and try and do it in the car. I'm finally back with Chelsea. Mm -hmm. ah! I'm in her dorm room right now, by the way. This is not my dorm. Her dorm is down the hallway from mine. Like, literally, you open the door, and my door is just... Oh. 
<laughs> right there. We'll show you guys at the end, but I'll also show you guys my dorm at the end. Okay, so this is Chelsea's dorm. Mine is that one right there. Okay, Chelsea's gonna try the Goldie Drops as well. This is like my fourth time doing my makeup because I kept trying it off. So I got here like so early in the morning. Oh, oh shit. And Chelsea Wait. was out and about <laughs> playing soccer. She had a game today, so I didn't see her. And I was like so sad because my mom was leaving, my family, like they were all gone. And then, so they left and I was like super emo. And, and then came. she came along and ugh, I just, I got all happy again. But y'all, this is the Chelsea from all of my first couple videos she's in like all of them you guys get chelsea and nadej mixed up all the time Whoa. they don't look alike at all like no not at all they're two completely different people Maybe. she's also like she has a lot of freckles yeah like i feel like you can't like okay, yeah you can see my forehead like i'm like speckled but like, that's definitely to tell them apart and they also have different names so <laughs> i don't I know how dinner. i'm hungry too let it like pass my hair though. Guys, I feel so much better now that Chelsea is here. Like, yeah. <sighs> Chelsea, nice. are you excited for the school year? Um, I think I'm sunburned. <laughs> um, I'm not excited. Okay, I'm excited, but like not really for the school part because I take math. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. Ah. Also, me? the chances of us landing the same building, same oh, floor. Hi. Right? Like, hello? So the plan right now is we're gonna go get dinner and- Oh my gosh, this ex exploded! Because we are so hungry and we then- We had brunch. Yeah. But and then, a different brunch. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, this is my favorite highlighter. Look at that glow. This my favorite eyebrow gel. Mm -hmm. I put it on. I also oh, have the brow wait. gel. We're matching and the brow pencil. It's the Kosas Brow Pencil and Brow Gel, by the way. Okay, Chelsea's telling me about how good the Ilia Mascara is. So we're gonna put it to the test. Okay, she has a little mini one, and I've heard that there's like shea butter or something in this mascara. <laughs> Chelsea's drying her hair, and then putting on her Hey! Last step, lip gloss. Bye, Bye guys!